Welcome back to Second Life and to Monash Island. This video will give you some of the basics in terms of movement and communication. Moving in Second Life is very simple. Your avatar or 3D representation of yourself can move around the island in two different ways, either walking or flying. To walk, it's very simple. All you need to do is click on your avatar and then use the arrow keys on your keyboard. The up arrow key will move you forwards, the down arrow key will move you backwards, and the left and right arrow keys will move you uh, in those directions. So if I was to walk on the bridge here, I simply click on my avatar and then using the up arrow key, move forwards, and then the, use the left and right arrow keys to keep me on the straight and narrow. This is a skill that you'll find difficult initially, but will become easier as you get used to moving in Second Life. The other way that we can move is by flying. To fly, I simply go down to the bottom of my screen here to the fly button and when I click on that my avatar lifts off the ground and I'm flying. To gain height I press the page up button on my keyboard and my avatar moves up and to lose height I just press the page down button and my avatar gets closer to the ground. Then in, to move around it's just like walking. The up arrow key will move me forwards the down arrow key will move me backwards and the left and right arrow keys will move me in those directions. To stop flying, you can simply press the stop flying button here, although depending on the height that you're at, you may come to a bit of a uh, unglorified end. The other way that you can do it is simply hold the page down uh, button on your keyboard and your avatar will land back down on the ground. Communicating is the other way that you will need to get used to uh, working with other avatars in Second Life. There are two different ways to communicate. One is a bit of a clumsy way for our purposes, uh, however it's important that you still are aware of it. By pressing on this button down in the bottom left hand corner of your screen, it brings up an instant messaging service. Anything that I type in uh, to this uh, field and hit enter will then appear on the screen for all other avatars to see and will be identified by my avatar's name just here. To get rid of that, I simply press on this little button in the left hand corner again and it disappears. You'll need to get used to using the talk function that I'm using here. And to do that, you left click on the talk button and anything that you say will be able to be heard by other avatars within a relatively close proximity to yourself. You can see that that's working by the uh, green flashing lights above my head. This is assuming that you have a microphone connected to your uh, computer. When I uh, talk, I need to hold left click and hold down the left mouse button uh, for other avatars to hear what I'm saying. When I let go of that left mouse button, anything that I say won't be heard by other avatars. These skills are ones that you'll need to be comfortable and familiar with for our sessions, and uh, Monash Island is a great place for you to be able to practice them.